Arbor Day came a day early in Vigo County. Thousands of trees were planted just west of the Wabash River. News 10's Jane Santucci explains why they went in the ground in this Green Living Report. Watching forester Brian Barger plant trees. We're planting, I believe it's 28,000 here uh, in the course of about three days. These seedlings are going in the ground in the area now known as the Wabashiki River Fish and Wildlife Area. Until a couple years ago, this was farmland planted with various crops since the late 1800s. Before that, it was a wetland forest. Now, Brian, along with others, is working to restore it back to its original habitat. Eventually, this is going to be part of a huge recreation and wildlife area right on the outskirts of Terre Haute. 90% of these trees that have been planted are expected to survive if we have a good season, but they will have to be maintained closely for the next two to three years. One benefit of the new trees, it will help purify the air. Will not take away the smell, but it will make the air quality much, much better over years. And one day these seedlings could become homes to birds and produce food for wildlife to survive on. In Vigo County with photojournalist John Tim. Jane Santucci, News 10. Very interesting. Well, the public can expect to start enjoying parts of the wildlife area in as early as two to three years.